Hi friends, DK this side. In this video, we will be doing IOC share analysis, which is not only the OMC, but it is an EV stock as well. IOC has planned to set up 10,000 EV charging stations pan India basis. Friends, we will talk about its news, discuss the broad fundamentals and then go to the price chart for multiple time frame technical analysis so that we can also arrive at IOC possible price target based on the price action. Friends, do not forget to subscribe the channel. Let us first start with the latest news on IOC share. What are latest news relating to IOC share? In the recent time, Sri Lanka opted to buy 40,000 metric tons of diesel and petrol from Indian Oil Corporation to meet the urgent emergency requirement in their economic crisis. Indian oil raises Iraq oil supplies to offset Mexico cuts. In the recent quarter three result of IOC, the net profit has risen by 19% to 5,861 crore. Now let us check the broad fundamentals of IOC. What we can see here is this stock alpha is very good. It has outperformed Nifty 50, the benchmark index by 16.6% in last one year. And profit growth has been amazing 454.9% on TTM basis. Pystroke score is 7, which indicates strong financials. PB ratio is just one, friends. So it is looking valuation wise also very attractive. ROC of last three years annual average is 13.2%, which is, of course, is the below uh, median of the industry. Beta is only 0.79. So it's quite a less volatile stock and hence it is a less risky stock. In terms of market capitalization, its market cap is in excess of 1,14,000 crore which makes IOC as a market leader and friends P ratio is only 4.2 on TDM basis which is lower than the median of the industry. So friends now let us move to the price chart for multiple time frame technical analysis on the price chart of IOC share and also arrive IOC share price target. We are now referring to the monthly price chart of Indian Oil Corporation or IOC share. What we can see after a massive bullish run, there was a downtrend over here. And then finally price uh, took support at something around 71 rupees, made a double bottom. And this was the reversal chart pattern, which was decisively broken out in February 2021 with a massive surge in the volume. And the volume was much above the average volume. Then price retraced to test the counter trend line. We can see this is the counter trend line, which was acting as a resistance. Price got rejected here, got rejected here, got rejected here. And once again, price got rejected in the June month of 2021, forming a shooting star kind of thing. And finally, after retracement, the price broke out of this counter trend line, which signaled the reversal in the chart pattern after the breakout of the double bottom, the price structure changed to higher highs and higher lows kind of for market structure. What we can witness, this correction started simply because the price got overextended. This was the multiple support at this area, which acted as a resistance. And now after the correction is over, price took support at EMA 21, which is a confluence of counter trend line and the confluence of SMA 144. So it looks like this correction is over. If we simply calculate the price target based on this breakout of the counter trend line, the first target comes at 164 and then possibly over 200. So it looks quite a good attractive proposition. However, at 135, there'll be minor some kind of resistance. But since it has already come in the markup phase, uptrending stock, this kind of resistance may not be a problem for up move of this particular stock. Now let us move to the uh, weekly price chart to further fine tune the price action to study it further. 
Now we are referring to the weekly price chart of IOC share. What we can see here, we can see the double bottom formation very prominently and up except the double bottom was broken out, price retraced to come in the demand zone and then finally the market structure changed to higher highs and higher lows kind of formation. In the recent time, this is the well-defined impulsive wave and the price took a retracement and finally took support on multiple confluences. Number one, the confluence of 78.6% retracement level, which is a derivative of golden ratio, but the price took support. At the same time, this was the confluence of EMA 55 and SMA 144. So now it looks like that the correction is over and the trend is likely to resume. Can we draw some kind of trend line will, which will help us to ride the trend? This is the well-defined trend line. Prices taken support here, taken support here, taken support here. Once again, the in the current week, the uh, market structure indicates a formation of some kind of bullish pin bar and the price is not trading above EMA 21. So this trend line is a well-defined trend line, established trend line, which can help us to ride the trend and trail the stop loss. And this trend line can be used considering the existing volatility of the market and one ATR below this trend line could be our stop loss. So friends, now let us move to the daily price chart so that we can study the recent price action. Now we are referring to IOC share daily price chart. What we can observe on this price chart is in the recent time, there was a downtrend movement and especially the price came in short term downtrend. However, the intermediate trend remained bullish. Here we can see EMA 21 crossed under EMA 55. So short term trend was bearish. However, EMA 55 remained above uh, SMA 144 indicating that the trend was intact in the intermediate term. This is the recent time we can see the price as uh, correction was halted here and finally price took support here which was earlier the resistance. So now this is a trend resumption and we can see in the recent correction we can see the price did not come below the prior low. So it indicates that the trend is resuming. Now it is available at, at a value zone. So we can always initiate a long trade considering the long positional view on IOC share for a very big target as discussed in the monthly price chart. So this is a stock for a long positional view or for the purpose of long term investment where the trend line which we have drawn in the weekly price chart will help us to ride the trend and trail the stop loss at the same time to make a strategy to preserve the profit that we are likely to make in the process of riding the trend. So friends, if you like this video presentation, give a lot of thumbs up to this video, share this video, subscribe the channel, enable the notification bell so that you remain updated all the time. Friends, I'll be waiting for your comments very, very eagerly in the comment section of this video. Thank you very much for watching. Looking forward to meet you very, very soon.